And what led you to believe that this number was a correct number for Justin Cox? It was posted in the Instagram comment. And uh, posted by the owner or user of the account. That would yep. call speculation, not object. If if he has a basis to testify, are you able to see and tell, looking at the posting itself, what name the number is next to? What I, I would handle renew the my objection. Also next. object on the basis of hearsay. If he's reading from a document. When we were up here at the bench. So, Your Honor, I'll ask additional questions that I think will. Sustained. So after seeing this, Your Honor, number, I, I have a motion, please. May, may we step up? Yeah. My object. Well, first of all, um, my motion is a motion for mistrial uh, based on the actions of the prosecutor. My my objection initially to the uh, to the, the item was that it contained hearsay. Um, the state represented at the bench that it was not hearsay. There was no hearsay contained in it. Uh, we did not address uh, the issue of what the state already knew, which is that there was a phone number attached to it that she was going to try to elicit um, testimony from this witness about who that phone number belonged to. Um, that is, in, a, in and of itself is speculation, but it's certainly hearsay. The document can't authenticate itself. So you can't, this witness can't look at a document and say it says this phone number uh, is from Justin Cobb, Instagram or social media posting, this is who it belongs to. So that was my objection. I believe the objection was well founded. I believe the state purposely put that up there uh, after misrepresenting as to whether or not it contained any hearsay in it. And based on that, I would move for a mistrial. May I respond? You may. First, the state objects to a mistrial. Second, Your Honor, what um, Mr. Adams uh, indicated that he did not want on here were um, the comments. With yeah, okay. the comments generally being all of the writing on the right side of the picture. Your Honor. And so I said we, to you, is any of it hearsay? Is any of it being offered for the truth? And you said no. Your Honor, what I was asking the witness to do is to tell what was of significance to that number and what he did in terms of finding out and corroborating information that he obtained because he obtained phone records. I don't intend that this evidence or this exhibit will prove or show that this is Justin Cobb's phone number. You're asking it, him that? And asking no, him Your Honor. To testify I, to that? I'm asking him, and I understand the court, I'm asking him, do you, not do you, what handle it's next to, and, Your Honor, what he did after seeing what he saw on this That's social media you page. Asked. You represented at the bench that none of this, that being the writing on the right side of the picture, which we're all squinting at because it's tiny on the piece of paper, and so I am relying upon you to actually be honest with the court and opposing counsel so that we can deal appropriately with the evidentiary issue. Was any of it being offered for the truth? And you said no. And then you turned around and after it was admitted over the overruling of the hearsay objection based on the representation that nothing was being offered for its truth, you drew the witness's attention to the phone number and tried to have the witness testify to whose phone number it was. If that is not offered for the truth, what is it? Your Honor, it what explains it? what he next, what steps he next took. It wasn't that he sat there and took this phone number and said, okay, this is Justin Cobb's phone number. He went and sought records based on what he saw on this social media post. So it's not this post can't prove anything, but I do expect that the witness will testify based on what he saw Regardless, because this is a legitimate. Why can't you just at the bench when you know that the reason you're offering it is for the phone number and then to ask the witness other questions about what he did based on that phone number and seeing that phone number say to everybody so that we know what we're dealing with. You know, it's this phone number and then I'm going to ask him X, Y, Z about the phone number and then we'll know what we're dealing with. Because my understanding that what was being objected to was not the phone number, was the comments, that <clears throat> was, the com was the words, Your Honor. And again, this piece of evidence does not. Wait, watch her throat is pinned. And again, this piece of evidence does not prove anything as anybody would be able to say. But when he saw this on Justin Cobb, the entire cross.